This is My Summer Car, one of my favorite games of all time. I'm currently doing an achievement run and sharing it with all of you here on the channel, and this game takes achievements to the next level, some of the most insane and nutty things you have to do in any video game you've probably ever seen. So last time, I woke up in the summer cottage for the very first time and made a game plan to go into the town to buy necessary supplies to build our Satsuma car, which is what the game is all about, but then also buy necessary survival food and items we need for the achievements. So we jumped into the tractor, drove to the village, and attempted to fuel up that tractor pretty poorly, was able to buy some stuff at the store, but sadly, it closed before I was able to make a payment for it. So I need to kill some time, I hung out with some locals, played a bit of Finnish blackjack, had a couple beers, and before we knew it, it was morning, the store reopened, and I was able to purchase everything that we needed. Once I purchased everything from the store, I jumped back in the tractor, drove it down the highway, and ended up in the most normal place ever. The dump, where I needed to find a sofa. This sofa, I can sleep anywhere as long as I have it. I can throw it in the back of the tractor, put it in a van, I can leave it in certain locations, and I can sleep wherever the sofa is. So, I took a nap at the dump, and that's where we are right now. <laughs> Dude, we're just sleeping. Have you ever just, like, gotten drunk at the dump and sleep in the back of your tractor? <laughs> Alright, I gotta deal with this thirst here. Also, I can't open up the bags for the chips, because all the stuff is gonna go flying everywhere, so... We gotta get home real quick. Too often. Just too often. Oh, man, we got some maximum stank, too. Yeah, we need to take a shower. No, no, this is good. We could Nighttime is good for us because there's an achievement I really need to get. One of the achievements is I have to flag down our cousin and give him the bird. There's also an achievement getting in the car with him and surviving a crash at 90 kilometers an hour. But in order for us to survive that, I need to wear the safety helmet. We're almost, just around one more turn, fellas. One more turn. The tractor is a slow ride, but we can just easily toss everything into the back. So it's, uh, you know, there's two ways to start this game, really. The first, the first way is to go right to the town. Actually, we forgot to get the wheels. We didn't really forget to get the wheels. I just didn't get the wheels. We'll go get the wheels another time. But, uh, yeah, we, went, we go to the town. You get a bunch of stuff for your car. You get a bunch of food and all that kind of stuff. Um... You know, play a couple hands of blackjack. Lose a little money in the VLT machines. You go to town with $3,000. You come back with 71 bucks. That's just the way it goes. Actually, I don't know if I'm going to be able to afford to pay Tamo for the wrench. Why do we have no money? You'll see in a minute. Ah, the bees. All right, here we go. I haven't done this in a while. Yeah, we gotta take a shower to get rid of our dirtiness factor. Gotta hit the trifecta. <laughs> shower dart. Alright. Woo! Aim for the drain, fellas. Aim for the drain. Uh, if you do happen to piss on your carpet in this game, it does permanently stain it. Um, if you're, if you're into that sort of thing. Okay, time to unload our supplies. Time to unload. So, we have, um, the trusty sofa. The trusty sofa, we could take that in the back of the van, mainly, and that's going to allow us to save and sleep. Got a couple of beers, which are absolutely necessary. We got some some coolant. Got some motor oil. Whoop. Got our car battery, which I think can actually die if I don't if I leave it out in the rain. I think maybe. I don't really know how that works. Got this weird seat that I didn't mean to buy, and then we have this. Okay. So we're just gonna open this here. Okay, so we got some light bulbs. Uh, you know, I'll just kind of, I'm just gonna leave this, this here. Um, gonna just leave it all in the rain. <laughs> gonna get a couple of these bad boys. We're gonna set this up here. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And around this moment, 
I realized we're missing a grocery bag, but not because I did anything wrong. Surprisingly, we didn't lose it in the tractor. Whenever I purchased all the sugar and supplies and potato chips from Tamos, and he walked away, it kind of glitched out the game a little bit. When we lost all the sugar, we lost all the food. It's not the end of the world. We still can drink these juice concentrates for food, which I'm going to need to drink them anyway, and thirst we can deal with with all the beer that we purchased. But losing the sugar sets us back a week because we can make our own alcohol and sell it for money, which means we're just gonna have a little bit less income coming in right away. But that's not that big of a deal, and I can fix the problem later on. But unfortunately, we did lose some money, but that's just the way she goes. Oh! Uh-oh. Shit, we're poor. I got no money for grandma. I got no money for grandma. No, dude, I needed the yeast and the sugar. What happened? It probably fell behind the counter after you paid. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. It's fine. Whoa, did they make the boat faster? This thing is hauling ass. I feel like they, oh, I, dude, I don't know. I feel like they made the boat faster. Oh, they definitely made this thing faster. I don't think I'm crazy. This thing rips. Thing hauls ass. I they must they had to have made this thing faster. Uh, they definitely didn't, and yes, I am crazy. It's either that or I'm just so used to how slow the tractor goes. Uh, all right. So we're here for a reason. A couple of things. Axe. Uh, they don't really need the axe yet. I mean, I could always grab it just in case we miss lose the other axe somehow. So this. Very, very, very key. Trust me, this is like a flashlight, but it's a candle. <laughs> I mean that. I mean it does exactly as you what you'd think it does, but it is. Uh, it doesn't run out. It's uh, so we don't need batteries for like a flashlight. Uh, this thing is a camera. I don't really know how the camera works. I'm assuming you just take screenshots. You can also do like some major zoom ins, but uh, yeah, we don't really need the camera. I can't seem to take screenshots right now. We got the fireworks bag. Um, you know, this is like... That's all that. That's all that, <laughs> that really does. I don't think we really need those. Um, there's, a, there's a kettle. So this is to make your own coffee. I don't, I don't know if we really need this. I'm just going to throw it in the boat. Shoot them at the train. I don't think there's any achievement associated with the fireworks, so I don't have to really worry about it. We've got the kettle. Okay, we got the coffee cup. Now, uh, this is the most important tool, but unfortunately, I'm, I am I lost a shopping bag. So, this is the money bucket. Right here, the money bucket. Cannot lose this bucket. It's one of the most important items in the game. Sorry, it's our brewing bucket. Uh, where is the fish trap, though? It's supposed to be somewhere here. Oh, there it is. There we go. We got a little fish trap. Okay. We got to go back to town and see if I can find the shopping bag that went missing. I quickly headed back to town on the boat just to take one last look at the store. And yeah, it was completely gone. No big deal. It is what it is. I guess it's a lesson learned not to buy a huge group of items just before the shop is about to close. So I got back on my boat and headed back home with all the cool stuff we collected from the island. 20 minute ride across this like riveting gameplay. Listen, it was to get some important stuff, okay? We can, we got our fish trap. We got our alcohol barrel. We got our wood chopping mechanism. We got a coffee pot and a light. Oh, no watch yet. We'll worry about that. Saturday night, we'll get our watch. 
Okay. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Oh! Well, might as well just, like, leave this bad boy right here. I think... I think it's... Yeah, it's closed. Yep. Yeah. Oh, we want to leave the two-stroke in the boat. Whoop! All right. And then, uh... Whoop! All right. We got the coffee pot. Whoop! Ah, fuck. Whoop. Okay. Man, so we got a lot of stuff done. Okay, so we got our we got we got the sofa. We got the bucket. We got the wood chopping thing. We got ourselves the fish trap. So we're we got a good start here. Good start. The only big thing that we're missing is the tires. Yeah. And I, I don't think I'll mess with the tires until um we get the van going. Build the car next. Listen, 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 listen. There's time. There's time to build the car. There's plenty of time. We're doing, we're doing like, we're going for some achievements and whatnot. You know what I mean? And like, we're, we're going to be here for a while, man. This is the second day of summer, third day of summer. We got time. No big deal. We got time. The car. Yeah, we got all summer for that. Don't worry. Dude, this thing is so hard to turn. What is this driving? Listen, it's harder than it looks. Okay, it's harder than it looks. What are you doing? It's just, it, you know, the wheels were big tractor wheels. It's big tractor wheels. Big tractor wheels, boys. Big tractor wheels. Okay, there we go. All right, boys, listen up. We got to make some money. And this is one of the ways that we can make some mad stacks. However, we're doing, we're doing actual work now, okay? We're doing actual work. So. Give me a sec, I got to get into the rhythm. Gotta get into the rhythm here. Give me a sec. There's a way we could do this, uh, you know, in a, in a really good way. Okay. Fuck. There we go. Alright, there we go. Nope. Pick log. There we go. Pick log. Nope. Pick log. Whoop. There we go. There we go. Now we're cooking with gas. So every now and again, you're able to chop wood and fill up the back of the trailer and drive it down the road and deliver it for a sizable amount of money. It's like 3,200 bucks if you completely fill the back of the trailer. You can tell that the trailer is full whenever there's no more logs that can actually visually move the wood climbing up the trailer. And it also sounds a little bit different whenever you're putting the wood inside the trailer. What's the point of this game? The point is to rebuild your dad's beatdown Satsuma and become the Finnish amateur champion in the rally race by rebuilding the car, doing various jobs, buying upgrades, pumping sewage, going to jail, getting drunk, smoking cigarettes, gambling against the devil, buying food at the store, getting blackout drunk, racing a guy who's drunk to steal his girlfriend, Having your girlfriend call you a pussy and then, you know, then you, you know, you get her pregnant. Uh, you know, there's a lot going on. There's a lot going on here. <laughs> Getting killed by your drunk cousin. Taking a drive with your drunk cousin. Going fishing. Making friends with a local drunk millionaire only to steal his money. I think he covered everything. Picking strawberries. Drag racing on Saturdays. Going to the Saturday night dance and beating a guy up and stealing his watch. Getting into a fight at the bar with the guy that you fought at the Saturday Night Dance. Pissing on TVs in jail. Going to jail. Getting killed by a train. Getting hit by lightning. Electrocuting yourself to death. Drowning. Pumping shit in the sewer tank. Lighting a cigarette and blowing yourself up in the sewer tank. Falling down a sewer tank. 
Smoking a cigarette at the gas pump and blowing yourself up. Winning the lottery. I forgot about that. Winning the lottery. Becoming addicted to cigarettes. Enjoying a nice Saturday afternoon in the sauna. Selling wood. Unfortunately, there's also some dark things. Like driving a man to suicide. But, you know, that's just... That's, that's, that's not your fault. Oh, yeah. You could buy a computer. Play video games. Watch TV. <laughs> I don't know. Burn your house down. I forgot about that. You can burn your house down in this game. Uh, various ways to burn your house down, actually. Run from the cops. You can do that, too. You can die. You can get killed by bees. Your guy is allergic to bees. <coughs> you can go blind by losing your windshield and getting hit by a bee in the face. For real. Yes. No. Yes. This is a real thing. We're going to have to go to the bees. You'll see the bees later today. Oh, we're full. All right, so that's it. It's it only takes a few minutes, but uh, it's not bad. Holiday presents. Turbo sticker. Random sum of money. All right, I don't want to drink this right now. Zero stress. Why cigarettes? Because we're trying to, we're doing it some achievements this time. So one of the achievements on hard mode is to get terribly addicted to cigarettes. Yeah, I know. Oh, yo, we, yeah, we got to get pulled over and blow 3.5 on the breathalyzer. So let's keep this bad boy ready to go for that. Oh! Can't pay for it. It's too expensive. Fuck. Okay, it's fine. All right, well, I, I, I ordered the uh, the wrench set, but unfortunately, I can't afford to pick it up. So it means we got to go old school with this. And, uh... <laughs> it's been, you know, it's been a while. So, all right, here, let's, 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 let's start over here, okay? Here's, here's what we're going to do. We can always... Start putting this guy, this guy down in there, the subframe. We can always start with the subframe. There we go. All right, there it is. There it is. There it is. We start with the, put the seats in. No, no, no. Oh, it was a 10. When in doubt, 10. Man, this is so much slower whenever uh, we're using the wrenches. Oh, fuck. What the hell was that? We're going to need some money, but don't worry. The money's coming. The money's coming. Oh. What the hell is this? Oh, there we go. Oh, she's a 10 too. <laughs> oh yeah, she's a little rough, but we're not rushing it. We're we're just gonna we're only gonna work on the car at moments where we kind of need time to go to pass, because we're still we're our, we're looking for our main achievements here. No, 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 that's not gonna work. This I th th this is this is right. This is right. No, 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 no. No way we put the spindle in now. I think we just got, I think we're good. Maybe, oh, there, no, it's working, it's working. It's just a little finicky. We got it. Listen, let's have a let's have a drink. Our stress level is also increasing, and I'm running out of cigarettes, which means I think it's we're gonna have to go to the sauna. But our stress level is probably increasing faster because um, we're 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 fatigued. But I just I'm trying to wait for the sun to go down because I I want to regulate our sleep schedule. I don't want to go to bed too soon and then we wake up in the darkness. You know I want to. We gotta re we gotta regulate that schedule. Okay, there we go. Okay, your stress should reduce with beer. It does with cigarettes, but you know, again, I bought the entire store's worth of cigarettes, and then the bag glitched out. So, you know, I guess there could be a lesson there, but uh, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> Don't put all your darts in one bag, boys. 
the game might uh, bug out. Sun's going down. I think we're good. Let's get. Let's jump into the sauna. I think that's enough work for one day. I kind of forget how the sauna works. Um. <laughs> so that is the um, that's the the temperature gauge right there. So we need to get this. We got to crank this thing. Uh, get this thing going. The thermostat's on. We cranked it. Don't want to burn the house down. You're going to burn it down. No, we're not. No, we're not. You guys are stressing me out. No, you don't put water. You got to let the coals heat up. You don't want to be dousing the water on it now. Yeah, you don't want to put it on the rocks. Water over the coal. No, no, no. We got to let them warm up. Yeah, it's cold rocks. Let's go get drunk while we wait for this thing to heat up. Okay. Yeah, we're just waiting for the sauna to uh, heat up here, fellas. I wonder if the sausage is still good. Oh, it is! I can't afford to pay the electrical bill, but we got power right now, so we might as well go for it. What the hell was that? I just ate the raw sausage? Uh-oh. I was gonna put one sausage on each one. Dude, it's taking forever to heat up. <laughs> Man. Come on now. Hurry up. All right, here we go. Oh, close the door, close the door. So after a nice, relaxing evening in the sauna, I decided to spend the next morning building and working on the car. I don't really have enough money to purchase the ratchet set and my air fuel gauge from Tamo's store. So until we get a phone call from the lumberjack guy, or I mean, not the lumberjack guy, but the guy that wants to buy the wood, we're kind of shit out of luck. There really isn't much for me to do. So working on the car is a pretty solid option because the sooner we can build the car, the sooner we can try to get inspected and the sooner we can go after some of the rally racing achievements. Please, please, please be the wood guy. Please be the wood guy. Yes! 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 Wait a second. Isn't there a time in which he accepts the wood? I'm pretty sure there's a time. He's not standing out there all night, eh? It's fine. All right, we already got it done. I've been waiting for this. Been waiting for this. My gas is not super great, but I think we can make it. Oh man, we're getting money, fellas. We're getting 3,200 big boys for this. Is he outside? Yes. Oh, I stalled her. I stalled her. Shit. Shit. Don't. Okay. Fucking stalled her again. Listen, it's the ditch. It was the ditch. Close enough. Nah, 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 nah. All right, I think we... I 
I think that's close enough. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're good on that. We have money! You can buy beer and sausages with all that money. Well, yes, I can! And I will! No, I think we I think we bring the tractor back. I think we bring the tractor back home. That's what we're gonna do. Cause like I, I kinda have like I wanna conserve my fuel in this thing. And I don't mind ripping around in the little dirt bike. So I'm thinking what we're going to do is we're going to bring this back home. And then we're going to sit in front of the TV and try to make ourselves tired to just like regulate our sleep schedule again. So we can sleep into Saturday morning. And uh, I want to be able to go to the Saturday night dance. It's very important that we go to the Saturday night, like, the Saturday night dance. So this was a relatively tame summer day. We went to the island to collect a bunch of essential supplies that are going to be needed to chop wood faster and make money. We were able to chop some wood and sell it for our first big payout, which is essential. It's going to let us pay the bills so I can keep the power on, keep the water rolling, and then I can also buy the ratchet set and the air fuel gauge from Tamo's store, which is super key. A little bit of extra money is also going to let me do a bit of gambling to see if we can get lucky or even try my hand at the VLT machine achievements. And overall, it's great to just have some gas money and to be able to buy some pepperoni. However, the next episode, we're going to the Saturday night dance because your man needs a watch and there's only one way that we can get our hands on it and you'll have to wait and see. Thanks again for watching. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe for some more My Summer Car and some other videos I'm going to be doing. And also check out the live stream, which is Monday through Friday, starting at 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. A link to that will also be included in the description box below. And like I mentioned last time, but I failed to add the link for a very long time, we do have My Summer Car merch that is available right now. You can check that out in the description box if you are interested, especially if you're a fan of some of the content I ran last year. This shirt immortalizes it in the best possible way. Thanks again, and I'll catch you all next time.